Hi all, this is your girl Natasha, and my tea kettle has brewed over. My has it brewed over. Well, I'm serving refreshments. I'm serving Lorna June, Milano cookies, milk chocolate, and dark chocolate. They're both my favorite. And I have an assortment of cold cuts and cheese. And I'm adding Swiss cheese. I like the holes in them. <laughs> and I'm serving fruits. And I'm serving chocolates. Russell Stover's. Regular. And sugar free for Jay Wilson. <laughs> I heard he's watching his weight. Anyway, my tea partiers, I'm here to talk about, what is this I'm hearing about Maddie, T.S. Madison, back in the news, people talking about her, especially that Wiley thinking that he's going to get on Madison's show after he slandered Maddie not too long ago when he was with that Susie Codoon under TSS. Oh, there's my cat in the window. That's her window. I thought I saw something jumping. Anyway, Wally, don't be ridiculous. Now, after you tried to slander T.S. Madison's name, do you really think that Maddie would have you on her show? Come on. Wally, let's not be ridiculous. Maddie would never have you on her show. And one thing I don't understand, why does Madison come into everything? Maddie is doing her brand, her Supreme Court show. She's traveling all over the place. It's preposterous how everyone is in her tea, especially Wally, thinking he's going to get on her show and get clout, clicks and views. I know you, Wally. I used to call myself the former first lady. <laughs> I know you well, dear. And I hear Sean Bradley didn't like um Maddie. Well, I will say this, and I won't be vicious, but I always had an idea that Sean Bradley wasn't too keen on transgender women. And me being a trans woman of experience, I sensed that. And I never said anything because there was nothing to say. The LGBT community is always divided like that sometimes. The gay men such as Sean, I'll even go so far as to call him a queen. They don't like the trans women for whatever reason. I never could figure that out. So, it's to be expected. I figured that out a long time. I observed. I had a cortisone shot in my back, so mm, I'm feeling kind of good. But yes, I had to step out. And yes, James Corwell today read to the sock. Expose some things and I mean, hey, James is Capricorn like I and a few others, sweet ma. And we're very sweet. Let me tell you about Capricorn briefly. We're very sweet. We don't bother anybody. We stay neutral the majority of the time, if we have an opinion, we can ourselves. 
But when we start hearing our name and we didn't do anything or being lied on, we have to come out and speak. And that is what I am doing for T.S. Madison. Maddie is doing her thing, the Queen's Court, which, by the way, this past Monday, I thoroughly enjoyed with James Wright Chanel. I call him the Patty Girl Pie. <laughs> And then she had a trans woman, just Kelly, and a few others that Maddie has had. I've enjoyed her show immensely. So therefore, I don't understand why Maddie is being attacked. I mean, my goodness, Wally, stop it. You're on your show and talking about people writing or whatever for you to be on Madison's show, it fall on deaf ears. Come on, Wiley. Keep doing your show and keep Madison out of your mouth and stop dreaming of being on her show because I don't think it will be a reality. And you all start liking my videos. Yeah, start liking them. I'm back. I had a cortisone shot in my back. Yes, people have made fun of me about my back. But you know, sometimes if something hits you unexpectedly, 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 ugh, tongue twister, then you'll see. It's been said I can't walk. I, I use a, a, a walk, all kind of things have been said, which is not surprising, because that's what people do. But as long as you know the truth, then Caldwell. James Caldwell spoke his truth. Now I see Wally and other people are dissecting it and tearing James Cowell apart. For what? I mean, that's James' experience. I don't get it. When people have their own experiences and they're sharing, why do people get all upset? I mean, if that's what James' experience with Sean Bradley was, then that's just it. But if you like James Cowell, then it shouldn't affect you. And if you don't, keep it moving. That's what I say. If you don't care for transgender women, then keep it going. It doesn't upset me, especially at my age, a woman of a particular age. It doesn't bother me what people say. I've been called all kinds of names. Please, it doesn't bother me. But again, I want you, my tea partiers, who care to join me, to press the like button. I've got to get back on YouTube. I've missed it immensely. And I have a lot to say. And I'm also thinking of a transgender woman panel. And I'm looking for a couple of transgender women. Maybe like three with different personalities. I mean, one that's funny, one that's straight. And then there's me. And I think that that would be fun. And we would not only talk about trans issues, we would talk about different things from our perspective. It's time us transgender women come to the forefront and speak up. It's not enough of us on YouTube. Maddie is busy doing her thing. So I think that it's time for us other girls to get together. And again, we don't bash biological women. A lot of you... Women don't like the word cisgender, so I will say born biological. 
And like I said, I have nothing against biological women. But this is a panel for trans women of trans experience. So I want to get that coordinated. So any girls that want to come to the forefront and talk about it, and we launch this thing and see where it goes. If it flies, then it flies. If it flops, then it flops. But once again, I'm just tired of hearing Maddie's name thrown around once again when she's doing her thing, making her own money, and people trying to get on her show and all of this. Maddie chooses who she wants on her show. And Wally, all the, the rallying and 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 petitions and whatever you have <laughs> to get on our show. I doubt that it will happen. But good luck. And like I said, you all, too easy. Why get your panties all in a bunch, as I've heard somewhere? About James Caldwell telling his truth. It's all it's been known that him and Sean have fell out, and some members of Club Chat. Oh, well. Well, I guess it's just fun to have mess going on. Yes. And, you know, over the months it has upset me that Jay Wilson and Tracy are not no longer friends, but things happen. And Tracy was very upset. She was passionate about different things. And that's Tracy and Jay Wilson. He has his opinion. And a lot of people may not like him. But that's their choice. If you don't like him, then don't watch him. Me, personally, I've been accused of going all around to different platforms. But you see, I support my black YouTubers. Okay? Now, there are a few I can't stand. When I can't stand them, I don't watch them. It's as simple as that. You just don't watch them. What's the big deal? What's all the hoopla? Because James Corwell spoke his truth. He didn't do it maliciously. He must have gave a warning. He sat back and took all the flack and he read to down to the socks. Now people can take it for what it's worth. If you if you don't appreciate it, then disappear. Don't watch James. Don't believe it. But I, for one, have noticed that Sean Bradley never cared for transgendered women. And that's his right. Some queens I don't care for. So, I mean, it's just a matter of taste. Who you like? China, are you in the window? This is my kitty's window. <laughs> Where she can look out, okay? This is her window. I've heard shade about windows and, and blinds. This is my cat's window. I cannot keep her. The cats love to be in a window. So I cannot keep her out of the window. So this is her appointed window. <laughs> oh, God. Tasha, stop acting silly. But anyway, my tea partiers, that's all I have to say. Let's stop being so vicious. And I see Wally coming on down on James and and the foster system and, and him being a foster parent. Does it really matter? James told what he had to say and that's it. I mean, I don't see what the big deal and the big all the hoopla is about it. My goodness, it's just horrible. I hate to see us black people just, you know, 
coming for each other for no reason. But anyway, I like I said, please, Wally, you will never get on T.S. Madison's show. So knock it off. You came for Maddie deep. And now you want to be on her show? Really, Wally? Come on. As Corny would say, that's laughable. <laughs> I'm still trying to work on that Corny laugh. But anyway, all, that's all I have to say. And once again, please press the like button. And I will be back. Your girl is feeling better now. She tried sh cortisone shots she was afraid before. But it seems to be working. I hope it works by tomorrow. There's no guarantee. But anyway, like I said, I want you trans girls out there, basically unknown, to think about us doing a panel. I don't want too many, just maybe three, me included. And we talk about things going on with trans women and educating people. And forget all the foo-foo about T.S. Madison and let her live. <laughs> and you will know you all, you know, it's known that me and Tookie Cookie have our little spats. So I'll be bringing news about what's happened to took Cookie Tookie. Where is she? I was in Philadelphia. I would have loved to have lunch with her. And understand why she likes to come for me in T.S. Madison. <laughs> anyway, all, once again, press the like button. And I hope you enjoyed the tea party. And you will be seeing more of Natasha. It's high time I get back on these streets. I'm like Dorothy. I'm easing on down the road. <laughs> anyway, thanks for stopping by. Press the like button. I can't emphasize that enough. And to my tea partiers and the people who like me, who care about my platform, and want to see more, press like. And sweet ma, it was nice seeing you. It was nice seeing you last night. I missed you dearly. You're my sweet ma too. And kiss that sweet little adorable Amir. Anyway all, I hope you've enjoyed the tea party. Until my tea kettle breweth over again. I shall be back. Love you all. Mwah. The nails will be done soon. Bye. <laughs>